y equals negative x is a diagonal line and it's this line in this case we're gonna move perpendicularly so it has to be a diagonal movement to make a perpendicular line because we need to make 90 degrees so if the diagonal uh, the mirror line is a diagonal line then the flipping must also be moving in a diagonal manner to make 90 degrees because the rule is to make perpendicular movement so we take a point this point is two diagonals and a half away so you need to do the same on the other side a half one and a half and two and a half that's the point second point is one and a half diagonal away a half one and a half and the third point is two and a half diagonal away the same on the other side then you join and one thing you need to realize is that always when you finish a reflection you can sort of imagine flipping or sort of closing or folding the shape and the middle line acts as a line of symmetry or a folding line now the next example is what you call overlapping reflection it's where we do reflection in both ways that's where the middle line actually goes through the object what this means is that you reflect the top part of the shape downwards and you reflect the bottom part also upwards we call it overlapping the overlap so let's go through it step by step the rule is still the same each point must be flipped in a perpendicular manner over the middle line so let's start with the top triangle you see the top triangle these two points already on the middle line will never change so they will still stay on the same point they won't change because they're on the middle line already the only point that will change is the top bit so these two points will still be the same they can't move because they're on the middle line so we look at the top bit and it's two squares away so it has to be two squares down so now we're going to use these two points and this point to form the top triangle so I've now reflected the top down I'm now going to reflect this bit here which is at the bottom also up and that small triangle at the bottom also have a point two points on the middle line which will not change so the only point that changes this point that is one square away so it has to be one square on the other side so I'm going to use the flashing point the two flashing points and this point to draw the triangle at the bottom which is going to be reflected okay so now that I've done together mix the reflection which is the R so you can see that when you have overlapping reflection the same way the middle line acts as a line of symmetry or like a folding point or folding line that you can sort of fold the ship and they will lie perfectly on top of each other